today is Christmas tree day. There's this viral tree you see on TikTok. It's from Home Depot. It's sold out everywhere in Canada. I think I might have found a dupe from Costco. So I did buy a new tree. I wanted one that looks more realistic and one that was bigger. I just bought it at 6 a.m. after being on TikTok for a bit, researching trees while I was in Texas. And when I got home, it was on my front porch and it is huge and heavy and I think I'm gonna love it. So I'm gonna put it up today. If you guys watched my videos last year, you know I also have a second tree that I put by the stairs. So I'll probably put that one up too today. We'll just do a full tree decorating day and kind of any other last touches because I did my coffee bar already. That's in my previous video but just any other areas of the house, like the front entryway I still need to decorate. So we're just having a big decorating day today and I'm really excited to spend the day with you guys. I'm gonna make another coffee soon, I think too, with eggnog in it. than I thought. I <sighs> Look how many lights there are. It's the perfect height, perfect thickness. It's not like too thick. Like our tree was very like thick at the bottom. I'm obsessed with it. I swear it's a bit crooked, but I'm gonna get my boyfriend to look at it when he gets home. I can't wait to turn it on at night too. Wow, I don't even wanna put ornaments. It looks so good. There's so many lights. I have all my blankets and such. I usually put this on the front bench. And then my new tree skirt. I'm kind of scared to unwrap it because then I can't really return it. Like, do I want to do a blanket under there instead? Like, there's a lot of room. You know how people also do those, like, looks like a neck brace for the tree? <laughs> yeah, how some people do that. Oh. Follow me on TikTok. That tree skirt feels small. I want to cover all the cords. This might actually look kind of nice. Does that look kind of cute? The white, it just felt so small and like it really stood out against the green. So I just surrounded it in the green blanket and then I can bring it up higher to kind of cover some of the poles. I think I'm gonna leave it like that for now. And that tree skirt was like $50, which is so unnecessary. Oh my God, I just performed surgery on this blanket. Look at how many of these little things were in it. And I had to find them in this fluffy, oh my gosh, that took me way too long. But I am obsessed with this blanket, so it was so worth it. So soft, so fluffy. I'm just gonna be filming everything with this in the background. It's so cute. It's breakfast time. I'm so hungry. I'm having my usual massive pieces of avocado toast. If the fake's allowed until then There's just something about a Christmas tree. I changed the picture on the TV. I feel revived from eating and I have energy and I'm ready to go downstairs and get my other tree. My flocked stairs tree, I guess you could call it. If you were here last year, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. First things first is I need to get rid of all this. I need to put the tree box downstairs. These are all bins uh, that had the Christmas decor in them. This is my garland for the stairs, which I also wanna do. This stuff needs to get out of the way because my tree goes right here. Time for tree number two. Just out. My nice 
big flock tree. Got it on Amazon, I have it on my storefront. I am gonna get this flock all over this outfit. This is the Skims cozy whatever, but everything sticks to this and it pulls on everything. I have so many little pulls, like this fabric is so, so delicate. But I'm not gonna change, am I? Because this is my this is my tree putting up outfit. Like this is the most Christmassy little Christmas tree outfit. I forgot how annoying this flock is. And after the ease of that other tree, this tree's crazy. <laughs> It's not even labeled, so I'm only hoping this is the second one. Like the quality of this is embarrassing after the other tree. I mean, this one's just Amazon. From far away, it will look good once I separate everything, but it's so much work to separate it all. I'm hoping I have it in the right order. I think it is. After my other tree. Yeah, it's so pretty. This one is, well, I need to give it some time. Let me give it some time. Hi, I got hungry, so I started making a snack and I actually just filmed a little, uh, can you see my phone? I actually just filmed a little TikTok about the moment that I took the right step into stopping binge eating. I'm trying to talk more about binge eating on TikTok just with like answering quick questions or just chatting with you guys. I feel like it's a lot easier to do some short form videos on it because my YouTube already has so much information and so many long-term videos about it. So if there's anything you wanna see on my TikTok, let me know or any specific topics. But I'm just making my little date bites right now. I also made a TikTok about these, <laughs> but I'm making the easy version of these date bites. Uh, when Beth came over, we made really like Snickers date bites. And so you take a date, you fill it with or you cut it in half, take the pit out, fill it with peanut butter. And then what I've been doing is I literally just sprinkle sea salt on top of this, put them in the freezer, and I just pop them into my mouth all day and eat them straight out of the freezer. There's something about a date with peanut butter out of the freezer. It tastes different. Like room temperature dates, not that good. Out of the freezer, insanely good. So if you're a date hater, like I used to be, put them in the freezer with peanut butter and salt. And it's such a good little healthy snack to have all day. Mm. Okay, she's up, she's cute. It actually looks pretty good. Honestly, the flock helps. I mean, don't look too close. Honestly, it's really not that bad. I wouldn't get a tree from Amazon that wasn't flocked. I don't know why that is so pointy. I might fold that down because it's really pointy at the top. One thing about me is I have no idea how big things are. How do I word this? I don't have any depth perception. I don't know how big a meter is. Like I do. Okay, that's a lie. I know how big one meter is. I know how big like one foot is. I know how big one inch is. But if you tell me that this is 4.97 meters, so about five meters, 16.3 feet, I have no idea how big that is. No idea. 16 feet? What is that? What is 16 feet? I don't know. This has always been a problem for me. I don't know how big things are and I don't know distance. I don't know how far things are. If you're like, oh, that's five kilometers. How far is five kilometers? I, mm, mm, I don't know. This is just, this is just a thing about me. So I have these micro dot lights that I got from HomeSense and I'm kind of wanting to put them on this tree. Cause I remember last year thinking this tree needs lights. It absolutely needs lights. And I was like, I'll do it next year. And now we're here. So these I was planning on using on the coffee bar or on this tree, but 16 feet, I, is that enough? It's only two sets of 50 lights. That tree has 2000 lights. This is, this tree's gonna have a hundred? That doesn't seem right. I feel like I need more of these. I also just came across this light pack. I wasn't even looking for lights. Oh, this is not gonna be enough. You're joking. You're joking. <laughs> You're joking. 
No, I need, <laughs> what was I thinking? Okay, I need to go up by lights for this tree because this is not, <laughs> there's no way this is gonna cover the whole tree. What? I need like at least 500 lights. So I guess I might, I might weave these ones through the coffee bar because these might actually be a lot cuter than those big chunky dollar store ones I have. This tree, is, she's gonna have to wait because I think I'm just gonna order some on Amazon because I don't feel like actually going out into the world. Okay, well, I guess we're going back to the coffee bar situation. I did move the snowman. Let me just show you. Remember how that tree was bothering me when it was up at the top because it was too tall? I feel like this is better because it was just like, it was so high. It was like way up here, just really sticking out. So I think this is a little bit more balanced with it down there. Oh my gosh, that's aggressive. <laughs> I need to change that setting. This setting's nice. I don't even know what setting it's on. Twinkle flash, maybe. Oh, it actually does look really twinkly. It looks like little twinkly sparkly stars. <laughs> I get the appeal of the twinkly lights, but I think this would give me a headache. People cannot be leaving this on their tree all day. Like there's no way you're watching a movie and you have these like crazy twinkly lights going on your tree. So I think the twinkle lights are for social media and then they probably go off, right? They do look cute though. Let me try to put them up. trees wait this is kind of adorable i kept the big chunky lights and i'm glad i did i kind of like having both oh i get it i get the twinkle like light, light appeal okay i'm gonna try to do them on the bottom too but i don't know it might be a lot going on I love the coffee bar now. I love it now. Let me get my big head out of the way and show you guys the final result. I mean, maybe not final, final, but final for now. Twinkle lights are so good. Look so cute and so sparkly and magical. Good morning. I have the curly bangs going on today. I love when people have like a messy curly bang, but I don't know if I let them air dry a little bit too weird. It is a new day, of course. We're gonna finish decorating the rest of the house today. I did buy lights for our stairwell tree. So we're gonna put those on and see what they look like. They're like sparkly twinkly ones. We're also gonna do the stairs. I'm gonna decorate my whole office right now. That's kind of what I wanna do first. I just cleaned it up. I did wanna get something for the mirror, garland to put around it, but I think I'm buying a new mirror. So that might happen next year in next year's office, decorate with me. Is there anything else I need to tell you this morning? I don't think so. I knew there was something else I need to talk about. These new Alvaline outfits. This is hands down my favorite sweat set that I own. I am obsessed with it. I'm gonna do a full athlete haul so you guys will see everything, but everything's unisex. So I'm wearing extra small and they're actually oversized. Sweater, I'm wearing a small. I also got an extra small in a different color for you guys to see, but it's still nice and baggy and oversized. This color, it's so cozy, it's so cute. I feel put together, but I'm still super comfy. They're actually the best. These are the best. Take out all 
my books or rearrange the bottom ones that much. Like these reindeer look so random. It looked so much better when they were pumpkins during the fall. <laughs> I like the little candles. I really like the little trees. I think they look super cute. I like my skiing people. The reindeer are a bit weird. I don't know where else to put them and I love them. So they're gonna stay for now. I also have a little snow globe I put over there. I don't know. And now I can use my cute little decorations and I'm gonna decorate my mini little office tree. Oh. obsessed with this tree. The actual lights burnt out. So I have this little, these little lights wrapped around it. I need to get new batteries for the other lights so that it'll be a little bit brighter, but I love my little decorations. All it needed was these few little decor pieces. I was gonna add more to my desk, but it just felt cluttered and I hate when my desk is cluttered. So literally just have one little candle. I'm trying to figure out what to do with the entryway here. Hmm. Oh my God, wait, you just need six batteries? You can totally see the cord. Can you guys see it? Aw, it actually looks really cute. <laughs> okay, you can kind of see the cord. We've got a nice Christmas record at the front. Nat King Cole. Honestly, the main reason I decorate over there is when I'm taking mirror pictures that it looks cute in the back. And you can't see the cord from here. So this, this might be perfect. Now that I'm looking at these lights, I probably should have got two, but I only got one and I'm not waiting another day. We're doing this tree today. I have used so many batteries today. I've used like 13 batteries today. Pro tip, get your batteries at Costco because you can get massive containers of them. Oh my God, why is this so hard to get in? Excuse me? I love that the battery comes in this. So I can hang this on the back of the tree and you won't even see it. This is so smart. different features. Oh my God. They don't have a nice soft twinkle, but maybe it won't be as bad when they're spread out on the tree. Let's try. They look pretty bright, but this is a big tree. If only I could just throw this on and it would be on. Job. The top is a little bit, just don't look up there. <laughs> I definitely could have spread out the ones on the bottom a little bit more up to the top. It's also hard to see it lit up right now because it's bright in here. I need to show you guys at night, but it's not bad. It actually looks kind of cute like this. It looks better in person, honestly, it's brighter. Next year, I'll probably buy another thing with these same lights because when you look at this tree compared to this guy, uh, yeah. He's lacking. He, he's a little bit dark <laughs> compared to that monstrosity. This one has 2,200 lights. I'm eating a date with peanut butter. So I think I do need to add another set to this and just wrap it a lot tighter next year. And now we'll do the garland. Doesn't matter, it's Christmas in my heart. And I can promise Santa's coming to visit. No, he I am making this garland so much easier for myself this year. Why last year did I decide to go through these? I like rotated the garland through that. Why would I do that? Now I'm just putting it on one side, taking these little branches and wrapping it around. If you have stairs like this that have these little pegs, just get a garland that's easy to bend and has a lot of wire in it and the garland will take two seconds. I already did this whole side. It was so fast. I don't have to weave it in and out like a crazy person. I just have to literally attach it. Oh my gosh, this is so 
much easier. I'm so annoyed at myself that I didn't do this last year. But you know what, it's fine. Now I know there is no need to weave it through because no one can tell the difference. I think it's time for the full grand reveal of all the decor in its glory with all the lights on. Now, of course it had to be a beautiful, gorgeous, sunny day. So you're not really getting the full effect. So I'll have to show you again at night, but maybe that'll be in another video, you know? Keep, keep you on your toes, keep you waiting for the next reveal. I don't know. I'm gonna do a little tour and show you guys all the finished decor. Mm. Just kidding, I'm back. One more thing. I didn't put decorations, like hang any decorations on either Christmas tree yet. I'm not sure if I'm gonna decorate the stairwell one. I kind of like it plain with just the lights, but I might add some Christmas ornaments to it. I don't know. And then the big tree, I always decorate with my boyfriend. So you'll get that final grand reveal of that tree at some point, but it won't be in this video. Right now it's just gonna be empty naked trees, but they still look cute. <music> Hey there, buddy It's just me again Came into my mind last night So I'm just, I'm just checking in It's been far too long now Since I last saw you, my friend So happy Christmas From me to you Hey there, buddy It's just me again I wonder what you're doing now And if you're listening I just wish there was some way Things could have been different But happy Christmas From me to you for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I had so much fun decorating my house with you. There will be plenty of more festive videos on the way. So make sure you subscribe. I would really appreciate it. Share this on your story. I would also really appreciate that too. If you share it on your story and tag me, I will repost it. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one. Ah, yeah. Christmas!